All right, and we are live with the, I believe this is the third stream we're doing for the Evil Within. Uh, very excited to jump back in. I'm not going to lie. I've been crazy freaking excited to go ahead and jump straight back into this. Like, if I wasn't playing it for stream, I'd be just zeroing through this. Like, there's no fucking tomorrow, but saved it for this. I've just been thinking about this game non-fucking-stop since the last time we played it on last Thursday, I think. Someone was burning. I'm very glad I didn't play a high frame rate game like um, like World of Warcraft or something beforehand, where I'm getting like on my monitor it's only 144 hertz. I say only, but you know it's like 200 plus because I'm I'm actually rendering out like uh, 200 frames or whatever. But jumping from that to 30 is a definitely a bit of a weird juxtaposition. So glad this is the first game I've played today. So it's not going to seem odd. I still will not get over the fact that Interact is on Spacebar, Dotty. Please refrain what? from agitating the others. <laughs> I didn't realize there were others. It's so freaking random when they want to pop up. Yeah, frame rate. Um. Cause this is a locked 30, and it's it plays fine. I'm just not used to play PC games not at 60. Memories are vague things indeed. It can be easy at times for memories to be distorted by others. That is why they must be cherished. I think a locked 30 on PC is still viable, but um, am I supposed to go in there or something? Yeah, that was spooky. <laughs> that was very spooky. Um, yeah, lock 30 is fine, but like if your computer just like can't hit that 60 frame mark, like in my experience, at least PC games seem very stuttery and have frame pacing issues, um, which is not good. We have a key. I don't remember what our ammo situation's like. Can't go through there. We got shotgun ammo. We can go through. Yes, we can go through here. So before we can go back to our shenanigans, apparently we need to uh, find some other stuff. Oh. Slammo. Got some green gel. But we can't upgrade because uh or actually no, we, we we can still go through there, but the door to over here is locked. Which is odd. Might as well upgrade before we go ahead and get uh, vanished or whatever to God knows where. All right, weapons, critical, nope. Not even really using the sniper too much to be honest. Um, how we do syringe recovery? We should upgrade. Yeah, we should definitely probably focus on that. That's another 9,000 though. Probably leave that as is. Should probably focus on just dumping points into whatever's like the small stuff, I guess. My pistol's pretty damn good right now. 
sniper rifle's already pretty damn near maxed out on headshot abilities. Um, do we need more firepower for that? I guess I do. <laughs> Uh, I don't really use the Agony Crossbow, so let's... That's whatever. Let's see, Sprint and Life Gauge. Let's go with Life Gauge. Like, I've even been thinking about that, like, even just when I'm at work. Like, aside from, like, everything else of the game, I'm just like, man, I can't wait to, like, constantly go back and keep fucking with, um... With the upgrades. It's, uh, I've just been thinking about this game non-stop, like, I'm very excited to be streaming this. And I think that's why I need to... What the fuck? Um, I think that's why I need to institute the rule, like, I will continue playing the, f the entirety of a game if I enjoy it, if, like, if I'm having, if I'm actively having, like, a great time with it. Um, otherwise, I'll maybe just do, like, one stream or two for something I'm just kind of feeling kind of even, like, iffy on. Like, Resident Evil 6, I think we might be done with it. Because while I kind of like it, it's not like, oh, fuck yes, I'm I'm thinking about it all the time. Like, I, I actively love this. That That's not the feeling I have with Resident Evil 6. It is the feeling I'm having with The Evil Within, I, where I am constantly wanting to go back and play it. Especially more so that I'm just enjoying it more um, than the first two times I played it. I believe I this is. Before, I believe this is Rubik's estate. Got some. How did they get here? I don't know if the shooting the crows does anything. Can test it though. Can't waste one bullet. Oh, it actually died. Don't get anything though. So, uh, my bad. I remember correctly there are there is stuff hidden around here. Yep, green chill. Not much, but I'll take it. Oh, two more grateful objects. I'm gonna say boxes, but only one of them kind of is. You still have to be freaking strong as hell, just smash a freaking uh wooden barrel. Those things are not fragile in the least. Those are insanely fucking tough. You gotta be like a freaking superhuman to smash through that. Hey! Stop, damn it! Oops. I have too many healing items. I also have a lot of grenades. Let's put those on four because we don't have any sniper ammo. I uh, just gotta remember if I need more health, there's an extra one just kind of just chilling right here. Now what? Yeah, this part can be a little bit frustrating if you're not careful because um, there's one, the checkpoint system sucks. Two, there's a lot of instant deaths around here, so not a great mix. Crimson Post newspaper clipping: Tragic fire kills child, nanny in Crimson City, February 11th. 2012. Despite the KCFD's quick arrival and best efforts, a fast-spreading house fire took the lives of a young girl and her babysitter yesterday afternoon in the Park Ridge neighborhood of Crimson City. Lily Castellanos, age 5, and her babysitter, Juanita Flores, 56, were unable to escape the smoke and flames that quickly consumed the single-family home. Lily's parents, both detectives for the KCPD, rushed to the scene but were too late to save their daughter from the flames. The blaze was finally defeated by firefighters after several hours, but the home was completely destroyed. The cause of the fire is under investigation, but initial findings point to faulty electric wiring. Continued on page 8, uh, fire. Okay, so we know Sebastian's uh, daughter died in a fire, as well as the uh, nanny babysitter. Uh, I can see why he became a bit of an alcoholic. We just, I don't really need to upgrade, I didn't get much. Oh, you know what? No, no, no. That is incorrect. 
Uh, we need to save. You think you should use your green gel? Because we can die very easily in this entire level, so... Save. Alright, so we did... Wrong key. <laughs> using a new keyboard this time, also. This is the first time I'm using it on stream. It's basically just a newer version of what I had before. It's a bit more comfortable, has a bit more functionality to it. Um, in, in some games, not in this one, but in, uh, in stuff like Gears 5, I noticed that it's only like specifically lighting up the keys that you can that you can actively use in the game. It's like it had like Y highlighted because there's a there's an action for it on there, but there wasn't like P or O wasn't uh, highlighted because those don't have a function within the game. So I thought that was pretty damn cool. I didn't even know it was a thing when I bought the keyboard. I just bought it because it's the newer version of what I had and I liked what I had, so I will get it. Uh, mansion dining room notes. I finally come to recognize the way, the portal to a new world. The details are all there, have been right in front of my nose. I'm appalled and incensed that I did not see them sooner. The specific process to break down a human psyche, to obliterate it and give myself free reign, is so obvious. And now that I see it, now what I have to do is in front of me. I feel as if there's nothing else I can do. I have everything I sought, everything I've lost. But I need resources, Jimenez. That Cretan will finally begin to earn his keep. So Jimenez is in bed with, um, I thought those were screen gel, those are just screen bottles. Um, Jimenez is, is in cahoots to some degree with, uh, Ruvik. There's an enemy. Let me see if I can pull this shit off. I don't know if that worked. I hope it worked. Oh, I forgot about these. <laughs> oh shit, that is... We gotta run. If he touches you, you are fucking dead. So I'm gonna play uh, footsies with him. I'm gonna run until his timer runs out. God damn it. Fucking teleporting piece of shit. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that that's what I meant when uh he just likes to pop up. And you can hide like under the uh table, but uh sometimes he just finds you. And uh there's not much you can do when he finds you and then he just blows you up like that. So, good thing I saved. So let's try that again because we were relatively close. I'm not gonna read that note again. Well, I'm gonna pick it up. I'm not gonna narrate it. Please don't pop up this time. I'm pretty sure it's predetermined, but. Sh shit. Yeah, I don't think the grenade did jack shit to him last time. Alright, so it's too dark and they usually use that area to like just kinda outmaneuver him until he kinda gets tired of chasing. But evidently that did not work. Two things of green gel. Let's see. What do we have here? Got a little bit of a brain puzzle. Um Subject number fifty-eight, test ninety-two A, electrode placement in M thirty three. M thirty three effective. greater results. So we have to look at the diagram and Put the pin in the same place. Is roughly okay. So that's the wrong one right here. We gotta go. 
traits here. Individual personality traits linger. Damn it. Here? Okay. Not doing too well. M33 pain. Okay. This is the consent. Need the right here then, right? Okay. I uh, replay tape. Subject number fifty-eight. Test ninety-two A. Electrode placement M thirty-three. Okay, that's ineffective. Never mind. Anticipate greater results with stimulation of section F seven. No, that's considerably easier. There we go. I don't know why it's hurting me to do it, but okay. Great. What did I just set in motion? Is this what you oh. call your inner sanctum? A research lab with your own. I am most impressed. Oh, there's a why bolt right here. Back? I didn't give you permission. Come now, we're both men of science. Men of science are dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. You can show me your experiments. I can show you things. You wouldn't like them. Oh. You'd think they're gross. In science, one must do any number of things a layperson may find disgusting. I've done many things others would consider distasteful. You think I'm some kind of a monster? You concern yourself so much with your appearance, but that mind of yours, that's all that matters. That's Marcello. Is that Ruvik with him? That's a hell of a backhand compliment to you, like, you're so concerned with your looks, but it's your brain that matters. It's just like, so you're kind of capitulating to the fact like maybe he looks not that great. <sighs> Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Get out of the way, dude. I remember why I don't like this part. <laughs> Please don't tell me I have to go all the way back from the frickin' hospital. Okay. We're at least right here. Goodbye. Don't care. Already listened to it. Go. Is is he not gonna pop up this time? He's gonna be chill. Oh yeah. So each time we do one of those brain things, one of those gets filled up. Um, just for checkpointing reasons, I'm gonna keep going back here each time because Rubik's a fucking dick. But at least the game seems to be uh, making him disappear each time he kills me, where he doesn't reappear in the same location. So. Happy for that, I suppose. Don't really have enough green gel to justify um, repeat um, usages. All right, back to it. This this whole level is gonna be such a pain. <laughs> and damn it, I forgot we're gonna have to go back and fight Laura and stuff. That that's it grudge looking spider lady that's going to be a whole thing i don't know maybe next time he pops up i'll try hiding even though when i've played the game previously um it has not had the best of results but i am willing to try because what i've been doing up to this point has not worked Yeah, not not a fan of trial and error design. Man, this is a lot darker than I remember from playing last time. Like obviously, you know, different level, or whatever. But just generally, the lighting's a bit darker than I what I recall.
No, that's just a bottle. Sniper ammo. I really need to be better at using my... Oh, shit. Hide. Please don't find me. <laughs> this is gonna suck really bad. Oh, he's at the door. Please don't find me. I believe he just goes away after a while. You don't have to like... There we go. Okay, we're good. I believe this is the only part of the game where he kind of does this repeatedly. Alright. He's gone. Kid's laughing at a... Oh! Oh! Almost got blown up. I was, was going to say, kids in a horror setting are never a good idea. Either you're vulnerable, making stupid decisions, or they're the ones freaking tearing you apart, so. Kids don't belong in horror movies. They bring nothing but trouble. Let's see. Harpoons. More grenades. I maxed out on grenades, so I need to start using those too. Here's a book. Mansion music room notes. Two worlds separated by a jagged chasm. Above, faceless spectators mocking the tragedy. Below, helpless victims losing everything. Uh, so these both have... Um, key... Not keys. They're dials. Um, so we need to go find them. Please don't pop up, Reuben. Reuben. Ruvik. Whatever. Reuben Ruvik. <laughs> I would. Oh, here's a green gel right here. And yep, I'm just gonna continue to abuse coming back here to get saves. Because I do not want to lose progress. One of uh, my few gaming pet peeves. I believe basically every game needs uh, auto saves. Every game needs uh, proper checkpoints, unless it's like the point of your game. But in this case, I don't believe it's the point of the game that these aren't abundant. All right, right, left, or center? I don't. No, I guess we can go center, but we're gonna go left. Around. Please don't see me. There we go. Got a Cairo bolt. Gonna be a lot of stuff down here. That's just a bottle. There's not even that like that many opportunities in this first game that you're gonna be like super stealth. There's there's a bit of a skill tree for it in um, Evil Within 2 because it actually provides more instances for you to like take advantage of it, but not super great here. Oops, I don't need that. Ammo. Let's go up the ladder. You have a knife in your hand, motherfucker. I do not trust you. God, I thought I could burn him. I was, I would, uh, that's not fair. There we go. I knew I should have just shot him, but. Because I saw the freaking knife. I, I called it. I fucking knew it. 
I just made the wrong way to go about it. Wrong decision to go about it. Upper safe dot. We don't even have to guess which one it is. It just says upper. Well, that's morbid. Please don't kill me, Ruvik. That would suck. This is a bad hallway. I have died in that hallway many times. <laughs> I don't trust it. I'm gonna save again. Ultimate Chad strategy right here. Being scared of shit. May seem a little monotonous constantly doing this, but it is going to save us so much time. So, I don't mind. Okay. Get up here. Oh, of course, as soon as I... No. Go away, dude. <laughs> you cannot do that. Nope. Stop it. That is illegal. I don't approve. Stop. Let your timer run out. Come on. Come on. We can do this all day. I don't believe shooting him does... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> so he's not, like, super bright, but... Very deadly. What's in here? Ruvik's room notes. I saw her there again, standing at the end of the hallway. Long black hair, beautiful as ever, streaked with moonlight, eyes dark pools in her porcelain face. She wore her favorite red dress like a crimson sunset, like a streak of blood in the waning light. Laura, of course you couldn't be dead. But she is... Weird way to think of your sister, by the way. <laughs> There we go. Green chill. There's some hidey holes. Med kits. Uh, that's a bottle. Oh, someone's... Damn, it is freaking dark. Guess like I was just hanging out in the freaking hallway or something. Got some matches. Oh! There's a bomb right here. So fucking dark in this mansion, why? Some kind of demon screams? Growling? Oh shit. I sh I was about to say, I shot the button. <laughs> At least that's gone. 
That would have been a shitty way to die after exploring all those rooms nice and slow. Oh, there's a statue, which means a key. Mm, nothing. That's what I like to find when I open stuff. Absolutely nothing that would aid me on my journey. Oh, we can heal up and grab that. Um, a little bit of a health increase from these now, since I got that upgrade. Not like amazing, but better than nothing, I guess. To the fire. The fire hallway, the fucking chimney fireplace. <laughs> Again. It says someone sees me, but I don't see anyone, so... Or not that they see me, but there's enemies around. I guess it just spawned it somewhere. That is a dead guy. Is it going to tell me where I should be going? Beer. Subject feels as I do. This vessel is far too weak to withstand the psychological weight I myself bear daily. Alright, so I think we got to put in fear, so... That's going to be... Uh, not at the bottom. Hard to tell, because this thing's like, domed. It's going to be in the back, like, right about here, I think. Yep. First try this time. A lot better than the first time we tried. Oh, we got a checkpoint. Freaking praise whatever deity exists in this universe. his parents and you get all burned up. That's explaining why this guy looks pretty fucking ugly. Did I go in here? No, I don't think I did. Gel in the toilet, as is tradition. That's where everyone puts their gel. I do not like the laughing girl because that means Laura's somewhere around here. Don't pop up, Rubik. Don't fucking do it. Let's go save before he pops up. Escape to safety. <laughs> Alright, so we still have to go through the center and we still have to, um, Go to the top right area. Hey, let's see if I can upgrade anything. So I'm not hurting for health. I'm not hurting for syringes. Um, let's see if I can spend it on weapons, preferably. Um, Agony Bolts. I really don't use the Agony Crossbow too much whenever I play this, to be honest. Let's save that.
Have you forgotten something? I have not forgotten anything. I oh, know. Perhaps I have. I have a key. Um, let's see if we can actually get something pretty useful. I, like, honestly, I'll just settle for gel. I'd rather... Nope. I get, uh, Kyro shots. But you're basically insta-kills on regular mob enemies, so... I'm happy. I'll roll with it. You need to remember to use these grenades, though. Try over here. Oh, that is a glowing item. Lower safe dial. That is quite morbid. Can I smash this for a key? Nope. Oh. I don't like that. Ruvik slashed out everyone's eyes but his. That's Laura right there in red. He cared about her, but she died. Then he murdered his parents. Let's see what's over here. Oh, that's locked. Okay, so now we have the safe uh, dials. Do not spawn. There's enemies somewhere, but... I don't know what the combo is supposed to be. I can't even see what the frickin' bottom dial says. I really can't. I can't fucking see it. It's too fucking dark. Um, here. Brightness. We gotta jack it up a little bit. There we go. I can actually see what the fuck I'm doing now. I think it was seven up top, then two on the bottom. It's going off like the people that were there, right? Oh! Fucking shit. Because I wasn't sure what the combo would be. Uh, fuck me. God damn it. <laughs> Oh, this guy's still alive, apparently. Here then, right? No, we played safe. Assumption number fourteen, test eighty-eight C, limit priming, temp three, electro replacement C four, stimulation of the singular cortex, the hope center. Assailing the hope access improves domination of the subject's will, but domination isn't enough. Eight here. Nope. 
I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, um, let's not kill myself. I need to be smart about this. So it is hope C4. It's at the front. So it's very close to the front. Right? And there's just like little bottom parts. That mostly takes it up. And then, like, it should be like right here. But it's. Never mind, it worked out. I could have sworn I already freaking did that. But. Whatever. <laughs> At least we got that out of the way. The hospital has not received the family's usual donation this year. And why would they? Has the hospital been doing anything worthy of donation? The Victoriano family has always been a generous contributor. Where are your parents? They have gone away. When do you expect them? They did. I came to inform you that the hospital will no longer be able to provide you with assistance. Materials. Your research will very quickly disintegrate. How dare you come into my home and threaten me? Dr. Jimenez is up to some very, uh, not cool shit. He's, uh, just as bad. Maybe not personally killing people, but he's cool with this shit going on. Let's see, let's use up a syringe. Should probably increase the stock on those, I guess. Where's that enemy at, by the way? Are you in here? says there's an enemy somewhere. Oh. Let's see if I can stealth you. You're just standing in the... There we go. Cool placement, I will admit that. But I'm just here for the brain juke. Very odd that they would... Spawn it there though, because there's no reason to go back to that room. I've already cleared it. I only did it out of curiosity. That's gonna be opening now. Um, let's head back and save. So Revic got us what twice, I believe. Uh, second time wasn't as bad because we were checkpointed. So maybe a little bit better than I remember. But I remember like the first time I played this, it was. It was have brutal. Have I forgotten? No, I don't have any keys this time, so that's all you, lady. Apparently, another enemy around. This is a long hallway. Nope, that is Ruvik. Nope. Nope. Slice clean all the way. No cure for what I'm going to do to you. You are a Peel fucked up little kid. Skin. That's from you. Ruvik? <laughs> Please don't laugh. That is a... That poor piggy. Died for nothing. <laughs> Fuck this mannequin. There we go. Much better. Go. I don't know if the electricity lets you uh, stealth kill people after you get them, but... I will try. This is an unnecessarily long hallway filled with nothing. <laughs> oh no. 
No, I don't like that. Run. I don't believe we can fight this. Oh, fuck. Shit. Okay. We can do this. But I'm greedy. I want to get the jail. Uh, over here. No pressure. There's a lot of pressure, actually. No! Damn, I pressed the crouch button one too many times right there. I thought if I press it again, it would cancel it, but nope, his... His destiny was predetermined. It's it's one or the other. Oh. Okay, I was about to say, I did not already touch a wire. I know that. Grab that. Ooh, Sebastian. Do your duck walk a little bit faster, my dude. Come on. There we go. God, I love the crazy stuff that they're able to pull off in this game. Oh, I was gonna do that. Shit. Ruvix Orby Cell. Nope, shit. Damn it. That'd be it. Damn it. Gotta. That did something? Oh no, I have to punch it. There we go. Damn it. Oh, nope. Don't want to blow up. Nope. Damn it. Oh. Shit, run. There's a lot of set PC stuff in this game. Kind of bonkers. Kind of wasted some shack, some some shack and some shotgun ammo. That's okay. We still have plenty. Here. Some piss off farmers with torches. That's never a good thing. Very nice looking flowers, though. Very into your sister, my dude. Buy up all our land. They need to be shown who really owns these parts. So we're gonna kill them kids. Fuck them kids. Jesus Christ. Don't kill kids. That's bad. Hey, I think there's kids in there. Oh. I didn't hear anything. Jesus Christ, dude. 
Not cool, random fu- Oh. Pretty brutal. There. Not gonna lie. <laughs> That's really brutal. But uh okay now I remember his name is Ruben. But once he digivolves and becomes all burned, he goes by Ruvik for whatever reason. Go. Do I have to jump from here? No, but that's not what I need to do. Shit. Okay, so... What do I do? I just... I should run and jump, right? <laughs> I'm supposed to run, right? Like, that's the thing. Oh, okay. Should have done that to begin with. There we go. Well, that's three bullets wasted instead of just one, so... That's a thing. Or Sebastian could have just... Learned how to jump a little bit. <laughs> that would have worked also. I... Uh, I don't think we can damage this thing. It, oh, it's spawning enemies. Okay. This I can deal with. There we go. Oh yeah, let's... Oh, I thought that was Ruben's body. But he escaped. I'm gonna keep doing that. Use these grenades while I got them, basically. Burn. Oh, more grenades. Oh, shit, that thing's still walking around. There we go. Yeah, she is very dead. in the hallway, I guess. This is a good opportunity for us to use that med kit because every time you use it, um, you can't move for a minute without being uh, very hampered uh, physically. Uh, we're all good to go now. You can't really use that in the middle of battle. That's not advisable. Please, you must eat. You've got to keep your strength up. My children. Beatrice, we have been through this. Oops. Beach is that his mom or? Oh, yeah, let's get rid of. Um, I don't have anything in our four slots. 
You have grenade. Let's save the sniper ammo for now. That's where we're supposed to go. That's locked. So that was a pain in the ass chapter. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Next ones will be much easier. Well, there's one with Laura, which is also going to be a pain. But aside from that, uh, it's going to be a great time. This has like the highest highs of evil within, but also the lowest lows. That's for damn sure. Definitely a mixed bag. What? Why didn't you just keep going down? I am holding down. There's no reason for you to go up. I do love this camera angle, though. Very claustrophobic. How many have you killed, Ruben? Ruben? Does he mean Ruvik? Numbers are irrelevant. They received as they themselves gave. And they served a higher purpose. They furthered my research. This was not mere research. The things the papers say were done to those people, those traps. These vermin? These microbes? They're mine to do with as I please. But you are correct. This was not mere research. I'm close to perfection. This is abhorrent. This is my will. Your will is fucked up, dude. Um. Mansion basement notes. My children have been taken from me. Was it fate? Was it something he did? Surely not my perfect son. It was that fire. It ruined everything. Took everything. The children are not the same. And neither is a nurse is Ernesto. He said he was taking care of them, that they were safe, but now he says they're gone? How could that be? A mother would know such a thing. I can still hear my darling boy's voice, his laughter, and always from the basement. It cannot be. A mother needs her children. So that's, uh, Ruben's mother, evidently. Let's open these up. Brain juice. I don't think we really have much to upgrade. All, all the stuff I, like, really want is, like, super... High up there at the moment. Something's pounding though. My head. They never really explain why you come back here. Like, like there's plot revelations and whatnot that we're like currently going through. Who is that guy next door? But this thing, not so much. Guy next door. I think it's this one. Do you have any idea why this world is the way it is? What? Who are you? Hate. Hate. Ruvik's hate. The man's consumed by it. He wants out. Wants to get his revenge. He wants back what he feels the world took from him. It's not like he could actually get that. <laughs> It's not like he could actually get that. This world exists as long as he does. You heard something just now? Apparently, yes. Move, lady. Right in front of you. Alright, let's see if we can... Um, maybe we can upgrade our stock a little bit. We seem to have, be, have, be having a little bit of an issue with the syringes. No, that's... F we're still short. Um, we should be good on everything else. Maximum sprint time. We, we can get that. That's always needed.
Doesn't even feel like it's necessarily adding that much though, to be honest. Uh, granted, this version specifically from Game Pass on PC, I believe they start you off with a higher sprint, sprint speed by default compared to the original release. So we're already pretty good on that front. That's a lot of creaking. Can I like disarm these at all? I don't think so. Not these ones. That is a trap. Those are gonna stab someone. Nope. Okay, that's, that's a, I was so scared that was gonna fucking get me. Oh, uh, that was bad. Okay, I need to use my explosive ammo because already having issues with that. Don't hit me! Don't hit me! Don't hit me! <laughs> Look out for wires. Let's see, we're going to stealth kill some people. Oh. A lot of wires around here. If I, yep, like there's one there. I get you. There we go. Let's see, we can take that torch. Let's disarm this. Go. Oops, he had sniper ammo for whatever reason. Jesus Christ. Where is that sniper up there? Oh shit. There you go. You are burned. Um, sniper is right here. This is insane. Oh, wait, there he is. Reload. There we go. Would have been much harder to pull off with the. Oh, let's play with the controller. Alright, we need to freeze some people. Come on. Do not be afraid, my dude. Oh, what the fuck? Fuck you, dude. Really? You're still up? Damn, these freaking explosive bolts don't do shit. I gotta like hella upgrade them in order to do anything. That's kind of lame. Let's see, so I've used the explosive ammo. I need to shock some dudes. Apparently. over here. 
Oh, another sniper. Can I just do this? <laughs> That's the one way to get him. So you reload that. Battery pack. Okay. Apparently I needed that. Yeah, the explosive is... The explosive bolts are, are not doing me justice. Um, because I keep getting hit by them, so... Very dangerous to use when enemies are rushing towards you. There we go. Oh! Shit, where the fuck is that one? Over there. Okay. Pop up right over. There we go. Very important we take him out before we go through here. Gotta wait for the knife or blade to swing around. Oh, get down, dude. Oh, come on, don't be a freaking weenie. Nope! Oh, that didn't count against me, sweet. That would have sucked. Got another one for you. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ham with the freaking bolts because I never use them. Might as well. Probably use my shotgun though. Get some shots off. Let's see, let's heal. Get fucking damn it. That sucked. That sucked pretty bad. There's our battery pack. Which is opening that, I guess. Oh, God. Damn it. Did not realize that frickin' mines spawned, apparently. Okay. Should be good. As long as nothing else sneaks up on me, which this game loves to do. Um, okay, we need a heal. Still locked. Gel. Still. Map fragments. I am. I have missed so many of those, so. Doesn't really matter at this point. What the? Oh, what the fuck? 
I don't even remember what the fuck that is. Got a lot of shocking, or shock bolts, whatever the fuck they're called. Electro bolts, shock bolts, thunder bolts. Thunder would be an incorrect. Thunder is the sound, not the actual electricity. I don't know why he climbed up there. Apparently I gotta start using my shotgun. That is a statue right there. Hurry up and grab it. Okay, go, 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 go. Grab that, too. And then go, 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 go. <laughs> Slammo. Syringe. Uh, this is locked. Need power or something. I need you out of the way, or at least for you to come here. You're on fire. Well, I will burn all of you people. Anyone else? Let's see, what else do I have? I have regular harpoons. You're not dead. You are now, though. Where are you gonna come from? Over here? <laughs> Freaking knock that thing off him. There we go. Hell yeah. Got some grenades going. I don't need any bottles. Why is it constantly giving me bottles? Got a bunch of freeze bolts though. Gotta get those going. These are insta kill basically against mob enemies, so I'm happy for it. Go. No more stuff back here, apparently. I know there's like a key back over there, something. There's also gel. Angel. Don't like those sounds. Got plenty of shotgun ammo. I do not like this. I do not like these sounds that I am hearing. I find them highly disagreeable. Right, let's swap back to the rifle. Because uh, we gotta reload. Oh, that is a freaking wire right there. 
Oh, there's a bottle. That works. I... <laughs> that sucked. There's a bottle right here. I do not want to trigger this. I know it's going to freaking... It's going to smack me. I see the thingy right there, dude. I... I see the thing. This is going to fucking kill me. Here. We have a grenade. That did nothing. Oh! Oh, I could have disarmed it. <laughs> that works too. Wasted a grenade. Alright, so I guess we can go back. Got a bunch of heated stuff up. Oh, enemies. Oh, nope. Bye bye. Shit. I don't know how either you're supposed to be scary. Like you just don't need to you just need to avoid running into them. Oh damn it. Shit. Run. Do I have any grenades of any sort? No I do not. There we go. Found more shotgun ammo somewhere around here. I believe right here. There we go. Let's heal up one more time. Okay, now that's moving a little bit. Oh! Okay, don't run into that. Okay, there is the Maiden statue. There we go. Alright, so we gotta... Skedaddle as soon as we can through here. I have don't have shit for my crossbow. That's okay. Oh shit. Back up. Can I go in here? Please don't smash me. Okay, there's the ladder. I was about to say, please don't just like freaking retract and kill me all of a sudden. Our pistol ammo. This industrial area makes no fucking sense. What are those smashers for? What is this place? Defies logic. Oh, there's another fragment. Doing better than my first couple playthroughs, I guess, on that front. Enemies are around. 
This is a fact. Oh, you know what? There we go. I don't want to smash these boxes, because then they will be aware that I am up to no good. I don't know if I can stealth these guys, but I want to try. Nope. They saw me. Oh shit, there's two of them. Shit. Apparently there's a bomb. Shit. Okay, run. This is not a great place to, uh... Using my uh, frickin' sniper. You're dead. Where's your baby brother at? There we go. Nope. Damn it. There we go. Damn, they give a lot of freaking goop for this. Damn it. Shit. These things are getting freaking harder and harder to do. Alright, I believe now is the time. I should probably. Finally craft some stuff that I've... Because I've just been hoarding everything like crazy. Uh, explosion bolts suck. The flash and... Um, damn, flash only takes two? The flash ones are by far the best. Wait, whoops. Yeah, the... These are a freaking godsend. These are an insta kill if we manage to use them properly. Nope. I need you to hit the box. Don't hit the enemy. Oh. I heard a beep beep. Don't freaking explode on me this time. So you're already getting more supplies, left and right. I'm kind of dismayed by how quiet this new keyboard is compared to my old one. I kind of liked how obnoxiously loud it was. Get this going. Oh, that is way too close. There we go. It's just gone. That's convenient. Oh, yep, gel right behind us. Damn, we have so much freaking, uh, so much freaking gel. Laura, no. Go away.
go. Oh. I do not like this. Oh. I thought I saw a, j a jar. Audio tape, though. Everything I have, everything I am, has been taken from me since the accident by those who seek to consume me. They are in the darkness, with only the phantoms of my mind to comfort me, to taunt me. I nearly lost myself completely. But then I saw her. Deep down I know she was only an apparition. But I would regain my face. Recover what was taken from me. Restore her. My beloved sister, Laura. Journal of Sebastian Cassianos, February 27th, 2012. I've watched friends and colleagues die before, part of the job that I've taken, and it's never easy. But nothing can compare to losing your own child. I'd die a million times over to prevent it, but I can't. I felt so helpless when they lowered that tiny coffin into the ground. The pain is unbearable. I know I shouldn't, but drinking is the only thing that's, that's let me sleep for the last few weeks. I'm worried about Myra. This has been extremely hard on her, and her way of handling has been unnerving. She wants to be alone, has taken a staying up all night. Says she's doing work to keep her mind off the tragedy, but she seems to be closing herself off to the world. I know what tends to happen when couples lose a child, and I hope that we're strong enough to avoid it. So, dealing it with in their own ways, but if you played the Evil Within 2, you would know, uh... There's some other stuff going on here. Hello, Have nurse. You forgotten something? Why do you always say that? Oh, I do have two keys, though. I have a lot of goop, so let's do this. Oh, this one's not open. Syringe. Ah, yeah, it's whatever. Two of them. Green gel. Lacking keys. Yeah, I didn't realize the uh, flash grenades took so little, um, so little resources to craft. I'd, I'd be, I should be using them all the time. Uh, life gauge, syringe recovery, um, whatever. We need damage up, that's for damn sure. Let's get the damage on the shotgun going. Agony bolts, flash bolts, read the time on it. This way you can even get like multiple kills with the same bolt too, so hell yeah, let's try to do that. Uh, increase the amount of syringes. Do we do that or increase the... Yeah, let's just get that maxed out, that we don't have to worry about it later. And let's save. Then let's go. We still have about 30 minutes or so on the stream.
Nope. I would like for you to go away, Laura. I do not like you. You are too spooky. I do not like the noises she's making. Can I, like, shoot her? Yeah, it does nothing, though. Go away. Please go away. Go away with your no butthole having ass. That opened something? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, come on. The gate wasn't even open. Ah, oh, that death is so fucking nasty. I wonder how they censored that in the Japanese version, because they don't like uh, decapitations in their media. Oh, I gotta do this all over again. That's lame. Okay, I guess I gotta fight her off a little bit more. As much as I don't want to. At least we don't have much wasted time. We're just going right down over here. Come on, Laura. Fuck off, lady. Nope. Run, dude. This is so much worse with headphones on. Nope. No, dude, 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 no, no, I do not. I am so fucked. Oh, apparently not. But I still managed to get the gel because I'm a greedy asshole like that. I fucking hate insta kill stuff in this game. Matches. down I guess they give me one quick momento right. oh there's a funnel thing right there but how do I get over to uh oh slamo When he gets over there to grab that stuff, I guess I can't. Oh, 
I hate you, Laura. You suck. You suck a lot. Come on, get closer to That did nothing to you, apparently. God damn it. Shit. I would be so much cooler with these segments if it was literally just her, like, swinging at you and doing damage. It'd be so much better if it was like that. Go away, Laura. I don't- no one likes you. Okay. There's like little flame buckets around here and stuff that I can use. Shit. Come here. Going the wrong way. Shit. Come on. Come on. This way, dude. There we go. Oh, nope, there's a thingy right here. Which way are you coming from, though? Nope! No, you're going the wrong way. Okay, I don't want to fuck this up. I don't want to fuck this up. I'm going to look up a guide real quick because I always fuck this up and I don't want to do this entire segment all over again. So we are going to the Evil Within Chapter 10 guide because I don't know what's wrong with me as soon as I get to this part. I just cannot freaking do it. i look up a quick little guide. Okay, they're on the ceiling. That is... Yeah. Sorry, I, I just did not want to do this part again. Especially since they're not glowing too, it's a uh, bit of a dickhead, bit of design right here. Hey Two-Face Jay, how's it going? Loving the Bob Ross. Come on. Oh no, shit, shit, shit. Okay, these are just things I have to flip. They don't do anything to her. Nope. Do not fucking blow up. Um, I'm doing pretty good aside from this crazy boss chasing me down wanting to murder me you know just horror game things shit I am using a Nikon D3400 it is a DSLR okay. 
Nope. Don't like that. Can you shoot that thing? Got it. I just gotta swing around. Bye bye, Laura. There we go. Oh no, come on, I'm not dying from this. Come on. Wrong way. I can still hit it from this side, actually. Nope. Oh no, get, get out of the fire. That is a bad choice on your part, lady. I fucked that up. Come here. Uh, shit. I need to get my health back. Okay, um, I did not hit the switch. It's gonna make. Here we go. Fire. <laughs> <laughs> Survived that just to, uh, just to get fucking blown up. Nice. Ah, uh, that sucked. One. Two. Get closer to that. And I'm not dealing with that right now. Come on. Burn. There we go. Okay, so I need to start this thing. There we go. Get that out of the way. Nope. Come here. Are you not coming? Okay. I don't know where she went. to uh go over here though. Oh she just decided to leave me alone. I don't know if that's a glitch or whatever, but I'll take it. I'm happy. Um Is that gonna go away anytime soon though? Am I missing something? Um, nope. Okay, it's good to go. You just decided to buzz off for whatever reason, I guess. Very convenient, she decided to take her time right there. Something about elevators slow down demons or something, I guess. So there's... So we're done with the part of the game I was actually dreading the most, because I know who you are. That creates a lot of freaking anxiety right there. I know what you crave, what you fear. Will you be able to live with yourself knowing what I'm gonna make you do? Poor little Joseph couldn't. Too bad they dragged you into this. But either way, you're mine. 
to do with as I please. That's quite rude. All right. Oh. I believe that's the first time he's ever directly addressed uh, Sebastian, so... They are making progress. They're, they are becoming closer to one another. Those are... Laura's arms. You would think Ruben uh, Ruvik would be a little more uh, devastated seeing his sister... Well, two of his sister's arms, because apparently she had four of them. I should be, he'd be a little more upset seeing those cut off. But oh well. The long elevator ride. Shit, back here again. I don't want to be back here. Map fragments. Okay, so these other rooms are blocked off now. See if there's actually anything to grab. Nope. Gotta be like a couple items laying around though, right? Nope. Oh, that was locked the first time we get into one. Okay, never mind. Yeah, absolutely nothing else over here. Part of me feels like they'd try to hide a statue up here. Guess not, though. Yeah, we already came here. Bye bye, mannequin. Some kind of fumbling. That is Leslie. Doc, what the hell do you think you're doing? Trying to save us. Really? Because it looks like you're making another monster to me. I don't have time for this, Detective. Neither do I. <sighs> Leslie has been here before and made it back. He survived being linked to Ruvik, the only patient ever as far as I know. Wonderful. What does that have to do with any of this? He's our way out, Detective. Our only way back. So this is the room that they're actually kind of in in reality. Oh, thank God it's working. No idea how they're getting that to work from inside um, this entire thing. Because Ruvik doesn't want it to, and he kind of controls the joint, so... Oh, that is gnarly looking. That's it. That's fine. Yeah, no, no shit. <laughs> he wants the same thing as us. He... he wants out! And... There goes Dr. Jimenez. He's he's dead for good. Won't be seeing him again. He is legit dead. Not kind of dead, like like typical horror movie kind of dead. Or happened off screen dead. He is dead. Dead. Oh. Hey! I knew Listen to me, goddammit! No. 
while we're opening. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and save because this is just kind of a nice little surprise stream that I like to do once in a while. Uh, the rest of the scheduled streams you can find down below, but just in case. Um, I believe I'm scheduled to stream uh, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday from... Hey, Nitro, how's it going, man? Uh, just about wrapping up over here, but... Um, yeah, scheduled to stream on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, 6 p.m. PST to 8 p.m. PST. Um, if I have any other time on those other days, I'll go ahead and stream, but that's the schedule for now, so thank you everyone for hanging out, and we will hang out next time. Thanks for hanging out.